Hello everyone, welcome back to Subsistence. It is still February. The lake is still frozen over. I did increase the days from 60 days to a couple hundred, I think. It's fair enough to say. I want to go down to the southern lake today sort of hang out down there for a few days. I do have several lock picks on me. I want to go down there and um, open up the lake. I can walk out on it and all of that. I would like to get that opened up so um, there's not a cloud over it or the fog of war or whatever you want to call it. Just so it's not hanging out there. It's early morning, um, very beautiful morning. Hopefully it doesn't snow too much uh, while we're going down in that direction. I wanna go over by Aura Rock just to see what's hanging out on that rock. Hopefully something great. We don't have any animals in the animal housing. However, we did craft a second one we don't have any of the upgrades done on it yet, but we do have it. Um, I really want to get more chickens for more feathers and more arrows. So, with that being said, I decided to go ahead and craft a second animal housing. And I did move them out by the stairs to the doorway that's in the, uh, the wall, the perimeter wall. You can see the new alpha base um, straight to the north of where I'm standing, or the northeast, sorry. Um, let me get back up on this rock, and I'll show you guys where they moved to. I haven't been up there yet. I haven't, you know, checked on those guys to see what they have in their storage. I'm sure it's something great. I almost want to attack those guys, but it's probably best not to right now. Anyway. I didn't bring any water to wash my hands, and I don't really need the meat right now. So I'm probably just going to leave it. It'll despawn very soon, I'm sure. Glad I came over there and risked it for the arrows and the ammo. Very nice. So we are attempting to head We need to go to the south. There's another wolf there. I'm not really too interested in them right now. He's interested in me, though. Hopefully there'll be a couple of lock crates along the way. Maybe. I do need the plant fiber for the fuel brick that I need to make when I get down there for the stove. More plant fiber here and over here as well. And of course it is beginning to snow. We are still in February. So the snow is to be expected, I guess. Don't have to like it, but we do have to tolerate it. There is a locked crate just here. Hopefully that wolf will leave me alone long enough to get this. Protein bars, gears. I've not seen gears in a locked crate, I don't think. He's 
definitely chasing me, but that's okay. Sounds like he stopped already. I don't know where the rogues are. Um, it's been snowing and it's very difficult to find them on the map when it's snowing. Um, of course the map is also snowing, so... Or it's also snowing on the map. And what do we have? Right there. That would be rogues. Should we mess with those guys? Or should we just avoid them? They are kind of in our path. That wolf is also in our path. More plant fiber here. There's a crate over on that rock. This wolf will hopefully stop chasing me. I'm not so sure it's going to. Looks like there's another crate just down there. I don't need the food right now, but I am going to take it. Um, hopefully we can wash our hands um, when we get down to the outpost. There's a crate here and one over on that rock. And I hear the rogues. Yeah, right in the back. You're not supposed to shoot a man in the back when he's not really doing anything to you. Except running past you. That was just not being friendly. Looks like you have a bag underneath you, kind sir. This fern is trying to hide a bag, and there should be one more. There were three guys. One, two, three. Wow, this must be Collect Gears Day. There should still be a bag right here. I didn't get, and it is an ammo crate. And an arrow. Very, very nice. So I do think the rogues hangout was on the other side of this rock. Their campfire. Another dog. I don't remember exactly where they were. not too concerned with it. I just wanted to see if they had anything left in their campfire. But that's okay. So let's go south. Go up over this rock or up over this hill sort of thing. Um, it's still snowing a little bit or starting to snow again. Let's go south. I did see the fence. I'm sure we are nowhere near uh, where we need to be. There's a crate over here. Uh, we can move some of these arrows up here. Let's check the map and see where exactly we are. We have a long way to go. There's a chicken. And lots of ores right here. 
all clustered together like that. Very nice. Copper and iron. We need both of those. I'm not quite sure what's going on here. So three ores spawned in the same area. This is a nice rock for ores, apparently. Not too bad at all. Let's keep going south. Definitely need to make it to our outpost at some point. Let's get our bow back out. Um, the wind is starting to pick up. It's starting to get a bit noisy. Really hope this isn't a horrible storm. We do have everything turned off at the base. Um, everything that we could possibly turn off. I didn't want to turn off the fridge, of course. And everything else seems to be okay. This is a really pretty rock. Let's get over here and take a peek. I really enjoy that. That's really nice. Oh, Wolfie McGee. Please don't make me kill you. But, you left me no choice, sir. Okay, we are very, very full on loot already. I'm not quite sure what we can. Oh dear. Oh dear. What can we do here? Let's get rid of some biofuel. We need the protein anyway. Let's have the couple of blueberries that we did get. Let's open this just to see if there's anything in there that we can stack already. Shotgun rounds are lovely. Sinew, five sinew, woot woot. Very, very nice. Super excited about the sinew. Scrap, we're doing really well with scrap today. Biofuel, copper. The, um, Nine millimeter rounds. Yeah. I really want to get the adhesive. I'll just have these two stakes. Okay, don't go north. Continue going south. medicinal plant that we're tossing out. We don't have the room for it or the zinc. I feel like we're getting pretty close to where we need to be. It's so difficult to find your way in the snow here. Especially when you're not familiar with the area anyway. Lots of trees. These look fairly normal. I did see a man. Um, I see my outpost. I don't know where that guy is now, but I did see him earlier. piece of scrap here and more plant fiber. I really hope I have water in here to wash my hands. I do. I only had the one and that's all I needed really. Okay. Um, what can we put away in here to make things a bit easier for us? Um, we do have a bit of fuel here. Not enough, of course. Let's go ahead and make a couple of fuel bricks. Um, we need one more plant fiber to make 
three fuel bricks in total. Let's put some things away. Um, let's see, what else goes in this crate? We have more scrap down here than we have at the base. You go in there. I'm going to put the gears over here because I want to take them back with me whenever we decide to go back, that is. I'm in no hurry. The base is doing really well. Um, I'm sure it can sustain itself. It's not necessary for us to do that. So we have potassium here. We have copper and iron. And we have iron that needs refined. Let's see how much power we have. We're doing really well. Let's go ahead and ignite that and put the other fuel brick away. Let's put some arrows away as well as a couple of the feathers that we did um, get along the way. Um, we have that and that that goes in there. You and you go in here as well as the cloth and the um, zinc. And let's put the animal fat in here. So we don't have any food down here. We need to get out and kill something. I mean, we have fruits and vegetables, um, but we don't have any meat. So let's see if we can solve that issue really, really quickly. Um, probably over in the birch forest is the quickest way to solve the problem. And there we go. We have that issue taken care of at least for a few minutes. We're going to need more than the one piece of liver, I'm sure of that. We're taking some health hits because of the cold weather, of course. Uh, more plant fiber up here and another wolf. A second wolf will be exactly what we need. Or should be exactly what we need, hopefully. There's no reason for me not to be able to hit that guy. Alrighty. We have that done. Now we need to get back to the base. Two liver will be fine for the night. We'll do some more hunting in the morning. I really would like to be able to do some more cougar hunting down here, but... With this type of weather, I don't think it's very wise to do that. The storm is super, super loud. Um, I hope I'm not yelling at you guys. Not my intention at all. That looks a little bit better to get us through the night. Um, we do have the boar that's hanging around down there. I'm sure the wind turbine is doing really well with power. We're gaining, or we're losing 50. No, sorry, let me look at the right thing here. So the wind turbine is doing 0 0.12 and we have 0 0.5 going out. Let's go ahead and cook this meat. Put the animal fat away. You and you. Go in there, and you go up here. We don't have any more water cooked. Um, we need to solve that problem very soon. Let's refill the canteen. Close the door here. Our tomatoes are doing okay. Um, it's taking them a bit longer than I anticipated for them to grow. We have lots of fat in here. Let's 
Just waiting on the meat to um, get done so that I can cook the water. We have 62 um, cordage down here, which is really nice. We will probably have to spend a couple of days in between videos gathering wood for down here to make mass. We only have the one lock pick left. Anytime, meat. Anytime. Great. And let's put that in the refrigerator and turn it on. Can you wash your hands with water that... Ooh, you can. So why would anyone ever need canteens when you get the mining drill um, available to mine water? These just take up so much less space. Anyway, there's that. Um, do we have any more ash we can put in the garden? We do. Uh, we don't have any water in there currently. That's probably part of the problem with um, them growing a bit slower. But now that we have our hands washed, we can go ahead and add the water to the garden as well. And hopefully we'll have our tomatoes going tomorrow or the next day. Okay. And it doesn't matter that it's cold out. They will still grow, I've been told. Um, so that's quite nice. So we have iron here. Probably could turn on the generator. We need some fruits and vegetables and some water. And let's have a drink of the water over here so we can refill the, these anyway, hopefully. And let's go ahead and refill these and get back inside. It is just super, super messy out here today. Okay, let's do a bit of wood chopping, just enough to get us through the night. And hopefully... Ooh, there's a crate. I was going to say, hopefully we can find a little bit of loot while we're doing it. These six log trees are always nice to chop. Just looking around for a bit more loot. There is a plant fiber over here. Or two. Here and here. And a couple over here. Shouldn't take very much wood to get us through the night. Just a couple of trees. Nothing major. Let's go ahead and just chop this little skinny tree. Right? No, that's the edge of the rock there. Ooh, a moose. That's really pretty in the snow. I would like to have his meat and his sinew. We can't do anything with his meat down here. Um, I guess we could chop that up and make several pieces of meat or a couple pieces of meat out of the rack of ribs. But, um... Maybe we'll just let him live. Is that a piece of scrap? No. These rocks down here are everywhere, and they are very, very difficult to deal with. Um, the pig we could kill. 
but take a shotgun round. I do see a couple of crates over in this direction. Let's go ahead and get those nails and the scrap. There was another one right over here somewhere. Right there it is. It's blending in with the ground, it was hard to see, and it is starting to get very dark here. And cold, it's minus seven currently. Another building crate right here. Um, an ore here. I'm probably iron from the way it looks. Yeah. And another big tree right here. If it's not too cold, I would like to get that. be staying on the lower side of this tree. Eh, still pretty cold. The snow is starting again. It's very, very pretty. So pretty to look up at the snow. Let's get back inside and keep our um, fire going through the night. We'll do a little bit of maintenance work and then make some sticks also through the night, hopefully. And tomorrow I'll have to do a lot of wood chopping off camera to get enough sticks to make mass to make um, lock picks. So anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I really do appreciate all of your support on this channel and on this series. I really hope you're enjoying these episodes. I hope you enjoyed this episode in particular. I hope you're looking forward to future episodes, and I can't wait to catch you guys in the next one. Until then, have yourselves a wonderful, wonderful day.